once again, Norwegians and Icelanders of the Nordic continent, and welcome back to another tyrannically evil, out of the broom closeted, and baritone blues episode of God of War. <laughs> Wait, we should not be celebrating because, well, that's why you later on. Last time where you left off, we completed Ratatoskr's task of bringing all the stats of the Four Winds and Seasons named Jugir the Thundered Ear, the Rathford the Thriving Slumber, the Valen the Unconscious One, and Dain the Dead One to act as natural tree and root clippers of the Yggdrasil World Tree. As it turned out, Mr. Bitcher the Bitchy Bushy Tails had goaded Mr. Arrogant Asslife into releasing all the stats into Vanai, and were ordered by Red Tosker, the annoying Nagoth, to lure the stags back to the world tree with feed made from the leaves from that same tree. But their greedy ass palate prevented them fulfilling their jobs because they chose to fulfill their bellies with the detritus leaf litter instead. So, like a calm and reasonable person that Kratos is, Kratos gave these girls a nice petting compassion to their souls and stomach, unlike those nuts that drags and save the world tree from overgrowing across the universe. Once that task was done, we headed back home to show the complete mass to Team Kratos back at our tree clubhouse. Out of nowhere, Tyr has suddenly revealed that he has found an open back door into Asgard territory and was about to lead our gang into Odin's headquarters to discover more about that ancient hidden cracked rift. However, Brock, the blue bottom bullshit detector, says that this so-called back door into Asgard may be full of crap and found it strange that Tyr, the conscientious objector, has never mentioned this to anyone during our whole operation plans until now. In fact, Brock has peeped the Tyr in the Norse war god's underpants when he inadvertently pointed out that Atreus never uses the Loki as his personal name while in the treehouse. Then, literally out of the blue, Tyr suddenly channeled in his inner warrior rage and stabbed Brock in the chest with a kitchen knife and lo and behold, it was revealed that Tyr was actually Odin in disguise. Which is kind of not too surprising since I mentioned Odin is the master of all disguises himself a couple episodes ago. Uh, Odin could be the one who's been the uh, blind guest. Let me remind you that uh, Owen has been known to be a total ship shifter and a little bully, much more adept in skill than you know. There's tons of real life lore of Odin putting on several disguises. Just as Odin had the upper hand by grabbing Atreus hostage and threatening to cash in the blood payment from Atreus' name in exchange for Heimdall's blood, Freyr, the amusing artist, created an inspirational diversion and signaled Loki that Atreus to go barking mad on Odin's head thus forcing Odin, the rabies infected tyrant, to retreat back to the broom closet, now revealed to be the actual Narnia backdoor to his homeland. Feeling more bluer than Brock's skin, Sindri the sad shell literally teleported back to Midgar, where Kratos and Atreus meet up with him again to offer condolences and apologies to the resentful blacksmith, who is now even more pissed off and hot with contempt to Atreus for allegedly taking everything from him without a thank you. I mean, if it wasn't for your bullshit calling brother Brock, we would have all been felt for Odin's scrotal bag of tricks and be left with nothing to fight against once Odin grabs all of us by the balls. Moreover, what about the precious treasures, armor, books, artifacts, silver, and trinkets that we brought to you and your brother during your adventure century? Were you just recycle a slag and fill with your forge that you just throw into fire? Or were you just using us as your shopping service to fetch those valuables for you to catch it or display them in your treehouse to brag about it to your treehouse guests? And don't get out of the your home realm from top conclusion by shutting out all the family forges around the lake. If anyone's guilty of digging everything, it should be you, Sidney, and the rest of the midget open fuckers who tuck their hands into your short stuff and pants. You and the rest of the gang are partaking in the rows and gathering all the manpower and woman power in all the nine ropes to set drop Asgard down before giving it the old anal ramming. I guess I should stop bitching about our loss now and continue on our mission to find Suter in his volcanic forge and convince him to make coins with his wife Sinmara to unleash a humongous giant to fire a huge hole into the Asgard wall. Oh, by the way, I already, uh, 
figured out how to like let up all the abrasions, but I want to show it to you first before I proceed on with the mission. So anyway, I was uh, looking up on the god named Suter, right? And it turns out that according to the uh, official lore, he's supposedly supposed to like go out into like grinding up with a huge ass flaming ass sword along with his friggin' sons, well, or in this case a friggin' fire giant. And apparently it is prophesied that Suter is going to fight off Freya, even though like Freya is supposed to be on our side. Now, I got two guesses. Number one, Freya is another traitor in our Team Kratos group and was about to attack us and was uh, forced to fight off a huge, gigantic, freaking giant with a flaming sword. And in the end result, Freya ends up dying because uh, he was gripping a very terrible sword by his servant skirt. My second guess is the freaking fire giant with the giant sword freaking got all loose and uh, haywire and became rogue and uh, Freyr is forced to take down the huge freaking giant and to prevent it from killing all its friends and ends up sacrificing his own life. Now, I'm not technically spoiling it over here, I'm just uh, saying it what it is according to my research, okay? So, take a little bit of salt. Oh yeah, I can remember how I had to solve this problem. Yeah, come on. Okay, this may take a while, guys. I'll skip it up all right. Finally, got like, the brazier's lit up here. Right. I won't waste you too much time. Okay? Yeah, yeah. Oh, I did this before. It shouldn't be that difficult. Yeah, I think that's a bit easier. But let's try this. This looks easy. Yeah. Okay, now we got the Nordic V. Now this is the Nordic P and the Nordic R. Oh, 
Is that how you deal with your god at home? Yes, 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 I'm boiling! Fly away! Sinmara, just so you can sit here and wait to die? Is that, that how you want to be remembered for? Being be a fucking coward? We're together again. Come on. We're together. Does it look like together, Suja? Oh. Is that her heart? <gasps> oh, my freaking god. Oh, you can't freaking heart? It's not much. But it's enough. That's not even. Have you ever been in love? Yeah, uh, he doubled it. Yeah, that's kind of very dirty, you have her heart. And also a bit creepy. No one will succeed. And all realms save Asgard will fall. Yeah, you must die. Which is why you have to help us. But I won't sacrifice her or anyone. You would him. Sorry. We'll make sure it won't come to that, okay? Adam, 
Well, uh, what is it that you sure you said? I uh, thought you said you don't want to help. Oh, the blade. May I see that? Is it going to be a new blacksmith? It's a chaos blade, right? Ain't they a big race, you two? Be you can, like, uh, do a bit more fiery jock touch. Yes. Oh, you know, for a man with a very cold heart, you sure. Stephen Hotman. Ah. Look at. Hmm. Put those in here. On your heart? And I'll become your monster. Oh, you want your spirit to be in those blades? At all. Uh, okay. But the prophecy says you two have to combine. Oh, they will. They will. And this will work? Just not in the way you think. What have I got to live for? <laughs> but he does have a point, so. But Tony was dead. Oh, a oh, yeah, ritual swear. Okay. Follow me. Yeah. Blacksmith. Uh, ritual is uh, rude to uh, do it. Gonna make it a fish of eyes. Okay. Gotcha. Just don't point your sword at Tawar Shredder when we're done, okay? Surtur! Surtur has agreed to help us if we do not involve Sinmar. He believes that his fight and channel through the Blades of Chaos alone can provide the spark needed to bring forth the monster who will destroy Oyun and Asuka. This man of Ash! <laughs> oh, you two can get so much along, oh, Kratos. This man of Ash cares nothing for his life, only for who he loves. He bears her heart in his chest, and is separated from his own, and he is separated from her. I believe I understand his condition. Yeah. You two can totally relate. Spark of the world. Oh. Which is... Place where they fly and must find me. Oh, where they touch tips. You won't be able to... The point like a big bag. Oh, oh, oh yeah, that built the game. Oh, 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 everybody oh, 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 I did get sound. So hot thing you do is built that car. Oh, it disappeared in the flames. Bad walking. <laughs> what awaits us at this spark of the world? Magic. Primordial stuff. You can do ASMR and that stuff with that spirit mode. Ooh. I like this battle, baby. Ah! What'll happen when you change? Not like it. Love it! Won't be me anymore. But how will you, or uh, future new you, future new know when to attack Asgard? You got the heart. And how you will not attack Freya, okay? Like in the property. We're good. Yeah, I got that. I know, but like, in, like someday in the future, like, uh, you're gonna end up like uh, attacking Freya, okay? After maybe using control of the blade. Yo, little chest. Okay. Connor, were you here? The beginning of everything? The big bang? Yeah. Oh. What was it like? <sighs> like the big like the big bang! And, and flashy. Here it is. Yeah, definitely. The spark of the world. Oh my god, the lucky you have out there. There's a whole letter in your galaxy. I'll meet you, Cross. Ooh, oh, oh, oh. oh And he knows that we're gonna go out and get hard. Oh yes. Well what other choice do we have? None. He knows that too. He could be only in disguise for all we know, but uh well, what other options do we have, mate? Oh it's so fucking beautiful. We should have brought poet with us. Well fortunately that poet here turns out to be all in the lead. I just want to keep staring at that friggin' abysmal light. I hope my iPad can capture all of this. Ah, yeah. Yeah, where were we? Yeah, this is why I was thinking about bringing, like, uh, gods and space guys back in, like, a uh, Kinesis Protocol. I'm not gonna come with you, I'm not gonna come with you. No, 
know, Jacob, maybe after you leave this business, you should probably go, like, uh, become one of those, like, uh, virtual reality actors for next generation of, like, uh, God of War games. Maybe play as Kratos this time. Future Kratos. Kratos! Now it's freaking space, baby! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, it's all up, Sutra. I need to look for some treasure. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay. Got some extra help for expert insurance. Holy shit! Look at it! Look at it, Scott! It's not about this freaking cosmological archives. Holy fucking shit. <laughs> what about Samara? Should we at least tell her? No. Ah, uh, yeah, it, it's gonna pay her like fiery hot heart. Uh, Loving someone is enough. The lesser pain. That doesn't uh, make any sense. Promise. You stay away from Oh, me. is she? Okay. Oh, alright, bye. So we won't have to your wife, okay? okay? Enough to create this new you? Simon's heart is cold. So, <laughs> like don't believe it's hard. Your dad's now got my fire in those ways. There's enough of me and the sparks fire. Six out of ten, you it might actually turn into a huge horrible monster that we are forced to find you, but uh, I'll take those odds. Come on, Kratos. Let's light up the friggin' blades, mate. Alright then, here goes nothing. Whatever you're ready, Suter. Right, are you gonna jump in? Or are you just gonna challenge the fuck at all? Oh my god! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! He's ours, guys! Go back, go back, go back, go back, go back. We're about to win, Chase! Here's my game, so let me test you in heart. Get me! This will hurt. Ah, I've been through much worse. <laughs> Oh my 
her ex-dentist. To fight two batteries in Japanese, the fates both the sea and the sky as they crash out as one. Well. Their coordination in battle was unmatched. It is a pity that fealty to Odin is by choice and not corruption that debated by their death. I would always prefer a Valkyrie fight on my side. Their aim was to take the mask back to Odin and perhaps attract his with it. I hope news of their demise travels swiftly to Asgard. <laughs> you know what? Keep him coming, Odin. We can use a ton of chicken so far our campfire. Are you there? Oh, 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 my fucking god, I forgot about this guy. Holy crap. Oh, that was a chance. I'm gonna be in here and never drink guys. Suter! Suter! You better not die on me, man. I'm gonna fucking kill you. Yeah, 
Oh my gosh, no. Oh my goodness. These gut ass way again. We get hot hit guys. I'm not just talking about the lava. Oh, yeah, okay, right here. Another earthquake. This whole place is gonna fall apart if this keep happening. Bye bye. We're gonna get out of here fast. I need a drink. Oh my fucking god, we have got to ever give up. What the hell? What the hell is this guy? Oh, 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 yeah, yeah. Yeah, fuck it. Oh, 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 oh
That chops up feet and hands. <laughs> You're all right, Linda. You're all right. Now, let's see you see. All right, boy, up here. Oh, they own it, Spear. Look like a toothpick. <laughs> or a fun jacket. <laughs> Grip of radiant reflection. A grip that seems to build energy the more it is thrown. Successful axe range attacks now generate charge of permafrost skin, with successful precision throws generating even more. Hmm, now we get to it. There's a chaos. Ooh, can I feel it? Now those are some angry knives. <laughs> Perfect for chopping up whitey wyverns for turkey dinner. Let's see some green arrows. Yeah, too many reds. Damn it. Yeah, you know, uh, let's switch it in your mouth. For now. Mm, know what you want? It's okay. Let's do special items. Ooh, that's a thought cry. Let's try superior resurrection stone. <coughs> All right, that should do. And what's Tanfeller name? And I don't what think it's. What do you need, Hansel? I think I'll be all. Thanks, Linda. Oh, and uh, take care of that guy. Enjoy that friggin' squeaky orb you got here. Ooh, order chips. Hmm. I wonder how we're supposed to open this. I don't see any ruins around here. I guess that only uh, pops out if you complete one of the challenges, so. Yeah. Go oh, right over there. Hmm. How do I unlock this? Father, the sword. The sword, yes. We visited so many winters ago. Hmm. Yeah, this is my first time of doing the Crucible Challenges. You know? I never played a 2016 version of God of War, which is why I'm pretty clueless on how to activate the challenges. There it is. Okay, there's the end. Another one. And the H. I'm sorry, the H. Let me just say H. Yeah, I guess you have to, like, uh, complete, like, three of these challenges to activate the order chest. Yeah. And that must be the final one over here. Oh, that's where it is. Alright, let's go uh, do a few challenges. Alright, that is what I need to have. You have seen Sentry. Yeah. He ain't in a good place right now. But, who is? I'm right, sorry, of course. I know you and Rob. Just tell me you're gonna get Odin. Yes, tell yes, me. I will. Whatever it takes, you're not letting that bastard walk away from this. You will not. Damn right. And if in the That's process it. you happen to tear him a bucket load of new ones, he don't want him, I'll be rightly obliged. Oh, I'm gonna tear him more than a fur new asshole, will you do Don't you worry, mate. It's the. Okay, okay, you have to uh, press it on. Which challenge do you want to try? Let's see. The big enemy with the title. Let's try this one. Let's go. 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 Oh, 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 oh,
Five seconds. Who's <coughs> next? Uh oh. Ah, ah, jump ahead. No, you head out. Here's the 